Alright guys, for the purpose of today's video, we're going to be using snap caps. I got my magazine, as you can see, loaded up with these fellas. Clear up there. Awesome. Lifelike, way about the same. Here's one right up next to a live full metal jacket round. Alright. Alright guys, Reese Field from Catch Circle here. Uh, got a tactical tip for you here, guys today. Uh, just kind of want to run you guys through something that I see a lot of with guys at the range um, when they're worried about being accurate with their handgun, uh, hitting the mark, hitting where they want on the target. Uh, some of the biggest problems and the easiest problems to spot that I see when I'm on the range is guys who will uh, jerk the gun or squeeze the gun or, or just have too much, they're, they're, they're too tense or they're anticipating the shot uh, when it comes to the recoil. And that can really throw off your accuracy. That can really throw off um, how effective you are. So I just want to run you guys through a very simple and safe drill you guys can do in your home that will really get you to have a clean, crisp trigger pull. So let me show you. Chamber, empty. Okay. Got my dummy ammunition here. We'll be using today. All right. So like I said, a lot of guys, when they're about to shoot, right, they're either going to, you know, pull down when they shoot, they're going to squeeze, you know, they're, they're, they're tensing up too much, they're anticipating the, the recoil, or they're just, they got too tight of a grip, and they're going to pull down, or, you know, some guys will have too loose of a grip, and they'll just kind of pull up a little bit, and depending on whether you're left or right-handed, you know, they'll pull right or pull left, and all, all this motion, you know, either up, down, left, or right, when you squeeze, is going to really throw off your accuracy. So, I'd like to show you guys a drill. Uh, that you can do today, I like to call it a penny drill. Alright, that's the penny. What I'm going to do is I'm going to keep the gun flat and level, put it on the front sight. Alright, what this is going to help me to do is I'm going to want to pull that trigger without the penny falling off. If the penny falls off, that means I've been doing something wrong. So you want to, you know, find a still room in your house and get this done. So I got my penny up on the front sight. Alright, I'm going to hold it. I'm just going to squeeze off around, very clean, very crisp, just like that, alright? Rack another one through, alright? Put it on top again, very clean, crisp, see? You got you to gotta get it to a point, do that again here, you got to get it to a point where you're comfortable pulling the trigger, clean, Crisp, smooth, no jerking. We're able to pull that trigger. Right, I got my arms fully extended. All right, see it's difficult, but you just keep practicing. Keep practicing until you're at a point where you trust yourself to have a very clean, crisp trigger pull. Like that. See. So try that out, guys. Hopefully that'll help you out. In essence, what this is doing is teaching you that when you present that firearm, all right, you have confidence. 